In this video, I'm going to be showing you a smart suit document designer. So it provides a detailed guide on how to create and customize documents using smart suits document designer feature. So smart suit is a comprehensive business management tool that offers features to handle projects, workflows, and data management efficiently. The document designer helps you create professional reports, invoices, contracts, and other business documents seamlessly. So let's get started. So first, what is the SmartSuit Document Designer? So it's a powerful tool that allows businesses to create customized documents based on the data in their workflows and databases, whether it's an invoice, a report, or a project summary. The document designer helps you automatically populate data into pre-designed templates, ensuring consistency and saving time. So the benefits of using Smartsheet's document designer is it automates document creation with pre-filled data from your system. It also allows complete customization of templates, ensuring branding consistency. And it helps create error-free documents by auto-populating fields based on stored data. So now let's move on to the SmartSuit's uh, dashboard. So from here, you will see this dashboard. They have the resources right here, on the left-hand side, which is the SmartSuit guides, schedule a demo, how to videos, help center, SmartSuit community, academy, and so on. So what we want to do right here is to design our document or edit our document. So to do that, first let's go to template gallery. And now I'm just going to search for sales CRM and use the template. So now that we are in the sales dashboard, we want to now go to the document. So now let's just click on accounts right here in the top. And as you can see, we have this feature, which is the document designer. So click on create new. And now we are now in the document designer. So as you can see, we have a blank document right here. Now from here, we can add elements such as a line, a rectangle, a circle, a text, a link, or an image. We can also add fields such as account files, account manager, account name, account notes, auto number, and so much more. And we also have the settings right here for the document, such as the paper size. So if you want it to be a letter size, legal size, tabloid size, and all of the sizes right here. So to get started, what you want to do is simply head on the fields. And as you can see right here, you can add a bunch of different fields such as account files or account manager. But let's start on creating account names. So if you want to add an account name, simply click here on the plus icon. And as you can see, it auto adds this text right here. You can also edit the font or the size of this text, its position, its order, the font, the font size, the horizontal align, the border color border with text color. So what's good about this is you can simply drag and drop it wherever you want. So unlike the traditional uh, editing of documents, you can simply use your keyboard. But from here, of course, you can drag and drop them. That what That's uh, what makes it uh, good and beautiful. Let's say you want to add your company HQ address here. And as you can see, you can simply drag and drop them. So they have this little dots to make sure that all of your texts are aligned. Let's say you want to put this uh, company HQ address right here in the top right. You can simply add it right there. Make sure that it's aligned. So next, let's move on. Company website. You can add it right there also. So let's just add it. Let's just let's say we want to add it right here. Or just uh, line it up right here you can see and now we can also add our company social network as you can see if you want it like that but of course you can also add elements such as links 
or images. Let's say you want to add the image of uh, your Twitter. So you can simply add the Twitter logo and add an image URL right here, which is your Twitter account. So of course you can resize this to whatever you want. So let's say if this is the Twitter photo, so you can put it right here in the bottom if you want and put an URL to make sure that when your client or your boss clicks this, it will redirect them to your profile. Let's just remove that. And again, there are a bunch of different fields right here that you can use, such as your logo, main phone. So from here, we can add in type. So let's say we simply want to add a, a text. So it's right here in the elements. So add a text, as you can see right here, and simply paste the text or for your document. Or if you're just starting, just simply double click right here. It's the content right here, just start on typing. So introduction and so on. Of course, you can uh, increase the font size. You can change the position. You can uh, edit the border color. So let's just remove this and this. Let's say this is the introduction, like that. Make sure it's aligned. So this is basically how the document designer works for uh, the smart suit. So it's unlike the traditional way where you simply want to type all of the text first and then edit them after. So from here, when you add such fields, it will automatically populate in the document. And from there, you can simply drag and drop them whenever, wherever you want and design your document how you like. So as you can see from here, we also have this context field. So let's try and add this. As you can see, this is how it looks like. You can add the name, you can change this, but of course you can always edit the uh, columns right here. As you can see the table columns has the name and the notes, and of course you can add new one. So let's say a phone. So this is how it would look like. So you can simply uh, add this to the bottom if you want. Still depends on you though. So simply play around and explore all of the features. And in no time, you will now be used to using the document designer of SmartSuite. So that's basically it. So if you find this video helpful, please hit like and subscribe. Thanks.